<laughs> Carl Swift, Stockton, California. Yeah, that's the week, Channel bro. How's it going, man? <sighs> oh, I needed that. Oh man, what's up, Tony? How's it going, bro? I haven't forgot about you. I got you right here. I seen. Uh, I just read your message. <laughs> Sorry about that, bud. <laughs> I, hey, I have a problem fucking with. It's weird on the messages. Like, um, it says on the side, uh, loading, and where where it lights up, where the, uh, where it says I've read, and where I haven't read. Well, where it says I read, I haven't read, but it tells me I have read it. So it goes, it goes up uh, to the next area. So I have to backtrack uh, to read it. So. That's how I missed it. I just figured it out that they passed my a lot of shit I missed. Yeah. I need you to help me, dude. I'm a fucking idiot. Hold on. <laughs> VA. <laughs> I was in the hospital for two months. Uh, the VA hospital for two months. At the accident, so I had a uh, uh, had some towels. Him <laughs> <sighs> started my uh, my fucking. Uh, I haven't started my puzzle yet. My 3D fucking castle fucking thing. I haven't started it yet. I fucking want to. I want to fucking start it right. I'm going to put a table right here in the middle. What I do is I set a table up right here and then I build it right here. That way I can. You know, I watch the theater or I watch my TV right here. So. That's what I. Uh, I want to get started. I want to get started on it. Because. I like. Once I get started, it's okay, you know. Then it doesn't bug me. You know, once I get started on it. I'm getting a, a set here. That's that's uh that's 32 grams right there. I gotta run another ounce in there. Uh, that'll put us into uh, a, a two two OZs, two ounces that I just put in for the 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 batch that I just fucking lost half of it, you know, when I crushed it. <laughs> so that's the way it goes. Uh, fuck it. And that was the that was the cush too. <laughs> I know. So I'm going to throw one more ounce of cushion here. And then I'll give me two ounces of cushion on this. And then I'm going to go ahead and uh, wax it. And that'll still leave me uh, <coughs> an eight. So that was four, five, one, two, three. It'll still leave me with like... Uh, Three and a half ounces I'll have left, still. So what I'll do is I'll knock the other two, take two more, three, and I'll give me an ounce and a half left, and I'll give me three OZs of wax, and now, I don't know, I might get an ounce of wax out of the whole thing, I don't know, find out. I hope so. I hope I do. This, I've been hitting on this nail here. Uh, this is the one I've been hitting lately. I haven't been hitting on the other one, the big bong. I don't know why, but, or this one here, uh, I haven't been hitting on that one, yeah, I've been hitting on this one here, that's the one I've been hitting on, and I've been putting a, a wax right inside of there, that's what I've been doing, and just carrying it inside that dish, that's how I used to, I used to always carry it in this dish, 
This dish right here I've seen a lot of fucking wax. Let me tell you, let me tell you something about this, all right? <laughs> There's a story on this dog like rat. I'll tell you a story. Okay, I'll tell you a story. Okay. This right here. I paid three dollars for it, okay? Three dollars for it. Flea market. The guy had a bunch of stuff out there, you know, and I spotted this. And uh as soon as I spotted it, I knew exactly what it was. But he didn't know what it was. And I says, Wow, what's this? He goes, It's for uh it's where they uh they melt metals and they tip metal upside down and they have a little holder of metal and they tip the metal upside down and they put the metal right on that and they pour the metal into this glass. That's how they heat their metal up and they it's for rings and stuff like that. I says, Oh, Really? He goes, yeah, that's what it's for. It's, it's, a, it's a jeweler's tool. Yeah, very, 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 very nice little tool right here. It's a very expensive tool right here. It's very simple. Well, how much you want for it? He says, oh, eight bucks. Eight bucks? Eight bucks? I said, I'll give you five. <laughs> okay. And I only had three on me. <laughs> I didn't know. I didn't know. So I thought I didn't have five bucks on. I had three bucks on me. So he took the three. <laughs> I thought I had five. I only had three. So he took the three. So as I was uh, leaving that day, I went by and I told him. I said, "Hey, this right here is. Uh, you know what this is for? You what's that for?" <laughs> I said, "This is for oils." I said, "People that smoke oils." Uh, this is what they do. They put their oils inside of here. This is a, this is an oil pan. This is what this is. This is what they carry oils in. This is what oilers use uh, when they're getting high and stuff. That they put their oils in this, and this is what they use. No, but now I got that. I, said, I don't know how you got it. I got it now, though. <laughs> but it's, it's, yeah, that's what it is. <laughs> yep. That was a long time ago too. That was a long time ago. I've had this piece of glass for a long time. Yeah. And look where it is. It's look where it's sitting. It's sitting right, fucking right on my, right on my desk, right here where I use shit. That's something. It's something that I use. You know, it's something I use. If it's sitting right here in front of me, right here on this part of the desk here, it's something I use all the time. If it's sitting out there, then it's not. I have to go get it. You know what I'm talking about? So if it's sitting right here, I'm using it constantly. <laughs> Uh, uh, Kingpins called me today. Uh, these guys right here. They've got the best glass for I mean, this guy has got some very cool glass. Uh, you've seen in my videos, I showed some of his glass work. Uh, I think I'll go in and do another video because he got some, uh, he might have some really cool new glass in there. He, I bet he does. So, uh, I wouldn't doubt it if he has some new glass in there. So I want to check it out. So what I'll do is I'll go in there and I'll film. I'll go film a little uh, a little thing in there, and that way I get to uh, I get to go I get to film. I means I get to go look at all the glass. Okay. <laughs> okay. I'll do another ounce, and then I'm going to uh, I'm gonna clean it. I guess as Clean it all up and do all that shit to it first, though. So. Well, I just did that all over just once, and all the stems and everything. I thought that I thought that holder was just an ounce. So I never, I, you know, I never weighed. I always just fill them up. You know, I never really gave a fuck on how much I put in there. You know, I just filled it up and did it. You know, it's just how I did it. But uh, now that there's, I'm, I'm running tight on. Uh, on the on the flower, I got, I'm weighing everything, you know. So I'm seeing where no fuck I'm at, you know what I mean. So uh, as of uh, then, then then take a couple ounces. Yeah, a couple ounces. Right now I've got 34 grams in the one, and uh, it's about halfway. So I've never noticed how many went in and how much went in. I never did. I just pack them. Yep, that's all I do. I just. Yep. And just take them and uh, I just clean them out and put it in there. 
don't bother to weigh any fucking thing, you know? Why? I don't, there's no need for me to bother to weigh anything, you know what I'm talking about? There's not, because I just, it's for myself. What the fuck? You know what I mean? So, all I do is uh, put it in there, make it, and, and take care of my medical needs, you know? So, why, why do I need to weigh anything, you know what I'm saying? If I'm out, I'm in trouble. <laughs> it doesn't matter how much I weigh, you know. I use what I use, you know what I'm saying? So it doesn't matter if I weigh it or not. It's just a, it's just an idea. I'm just, I just did it because I, I'm running low on flour. I'm just curious on what it is, you know. I never really gave a shit before, but uh, here, in, you know, it won't matter, you know. So when you're, when you're running low on flour, you want to know what's going in there because you got to know how much you're going to need for the next batch, you know what I mean? It's not like I can just fill it up any time. Like I normally do, you know? Well, since I started the show, um, since I started this show here, um, I, uh, I've, uh, I've used more. I've used more flour, I've used more oil, I've used more, yeah, I've used more. So, and I'm, man, I'm so close to hitting 50,000. I am so close, man. I think I'm like a thousand away, maybe. I thought I was going to hit 50,000 today. I mean, I thought I'd hit over this, this holiday, you know. I haven't looked just, I haven't looked just now, but it was, it was a thousand away today. So, it was a little over a thousand, so I probably didn't make that thousand. Most likely, I didn't make the thousand today, you know. Not too, you know, there ain't gonna be a thousand people on my shit today, you know what I mean? <laughs> ain't gonna happen. Fucking <laughs> holiday, you ain't gonna lose my shit, you know. Well, we're gonna want to go to bed and shit. <laughs> Even partying. grinder you know why <laughs> you know why and then I can't pick all those stems out man there's still me I got it sitting right here but <laughs> you're a fucking nut you're a fucking nut you're a nut motherfucker you're a nut No, I didn't say you got nuts. I said you're a nut. Oh, I thought you were talking about my nuts. Yes. I definitely want, uh, you know, I definitely want the fucking, I definitely want the best I can get. You know what I mean? I definitely have a quest. I definitely have a quest of getting the best fucking product I can get, and I want to get where I want to get the flavoring, you know. I want the flavor. I want flavored wax. I want flavored wax, man. I want strawberry wax, cherry wax, you know, apple pie wax, cherry pie wax, you know. You know what I mean? Turkey dinner wax. <laughs> Christmas wax. You know what I'm talking about? Snowball wax. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah. That's what I want. I want some fucking flavored wax. That's what we need. We need that. 
smell it. I mean, I got I got that that dab on it's flavored. You know, it's flavored dab. Fucking, it's good flavored dab too, man. It's like fucking like taking a bite of a strawberry. And I, I thought it's, towards the end it wouldn't be like that. You know what I mean? No, still tastes the same. Still tastes the same. Curious to see how much this is going to weigh. I'm just now I'm curious to see how much is going in the motherfucker. And now I'm starting to uh, realize how much, how much weed I put in that motherfucker. You know what I mean? It's a lot cheaper if you was just a flower smoker, you know? You know what I mean? If you just smoke weed, fuck, you'd, but you'd have maids. You'd never run out. It takes so much to get this wax. You know, but you don't want the fucking flower. No, you don't want it. You used to want it, you don't want it no more. No, I don't. No, fuck no, fuck this flower. No, man, no, I won't always, I won't always send the flower. That's what I want. I want what's in the flower. I mean, it's always cool, you know, I mean, the connoisseur is smoking it, you know, how it tastes, and all. that's always been our thing, you know, oh, it tastes so good, and, you know, oh, man, I can't wait to harvest this, but, you know, that's, that's the whole, the whole uh, purpose of, of fucking your own, you know, not to chop it all up and put it into a wax form, you know, no, man, it defeats the purpose that all the work we've done to make it beautiful, and then just tear it up and put it into a wax, sounds crazy. When all you gotta do is just smoke this, and it's the top quality, and it's gonna tear you up. Piece of cake, just fucking taste, roll, smoke it, and they're done. Yeah, just roll it up, spend 20, 30 minutes smoking that whole motherfucker, putting all that smoke in your lungs, all that shit fucking head. And think how much you're smoking a day, too, how much of that shit you're smoking. Or you can just take a dab and take a couple hits and be done. <laughs> what are you going to do? <laughs> you know, you'd rather just spend a half hour and smoke all that smoke and put all that shit in you than just spend a couple of minutes and take a dab and do everything what you just took a half hour, 45 minutes to do. I did in uh, 30 seconds. Kind of makes sense now, don't it? Oh. Makes sense to dab, don't it? Yeah. So, and you're going to cut everything down, too. You watch. You think you smoke a lot of weed? Well, you start dabbing. You're going to do a couple of dabs, and you're going to stop. Because you're going to start going, fuck, I can't do no more. You're going to start realizing how much it takes. And you know mine. You know, mine is a one to three. And, uh, and I'm fucked up. Four is over the top for me. So, that's how it is for me. I could uh, run this like this. I have, and then uh, and then after I've run it like this, I'd have took it in, let it dry, take it into the grinder, grind it up, and rerun it again, and uh, still get two or three, four grams out of it. But you gotta re. Uh, Grind it though to do that. You can't just take it out and redo it again. No, you got it. That's only if you don't grind it the first time. <clears throat> like if you do it all by hand, like I'm doing now, and you get all your shit out of it, and then you let it dry, and then grind it, and then run it again, and you'll get three or four grams out of that. Well, why not just grind it up now and get it all? You could. To me, when you grind it up so fine like that, I don't know, man. It seems, seems like a... I don't know. It seems like it plugs it and takes forever to get through it and you're leaving a lot behind. And
about a half a gram. I, I, I didn't quite, it's a little bit more than half a gram. I put a gram, but uh, put it in the folder. Folded up. It's pretty nice, huh? There it is. Get you down better like this, man. We used to do old cocaine back in the day. This was this was old cocaine around. That's how we used to do uh, all our powder back in the day. We'd pull all our powder up like that. And, uh, yeah, back in the day, that would cost you like 90 bucks. <laughs> cocaine. <laughs> all right, what up? I remember it was in 120, 90, 80, 75. I remember all that shit. <laughs> there you go. There you go, bud. Reach in here, reach in here, reach in here, 
Montana, Tony Montana. You should be good anyway, huh? Show you the phone book of my town. This, this is my town phone book right here. Okay, this is, this is my town right here. This is my phone book. <laughs> this is my whole town right here. <laughs> Got my new game in it. My game in formal. It's a fucking bad magazine. It's like one of my favorites. It's like one of my favorite fucking magazines. Fucking all fucking time right here. This is like my best fucking shit right here. I'm so excited. I love this fucking magazine. I love it. I didn't know I even got it yesterday. I got it Saturday. I didn't even know it. Fuck, oh, man. This is me. Destiny is a Taken King. Oh, this is fucking a bomb. The graphics now. Check this out. Check out the fucking hey, the graphics now. The games, fucking awesome. Fucking awesome. I'm on Watchdog right now. I've been stuck on Watchdog for about a month now. I'm about ready to kill somebody. Fucking Watchdog. I don't even like that game. I don't. I don't even like that game. Destiny, Destiny games are cool. This one right here. It's fucking bad or what? Huh? Fuck, fucking awesome, man. Awesome, fucking dude. This is so fucking awesome. <laughs> fucking bad, huh? Huh? You imagine fucking going up against that motherfucker right there? All you got is a fucking sword. You know, you all you got is a fucking sword. And you got your fucking magic boots. If some monster has it, you here to check him out. I got something going on. That's where I get the, on the, the theater, you know, the speakers. You get a weird sound sometimes from off the, the stereo, you know. Oh, the bastard executor. Oh, that's fucking bad. Okay, the nickname game. That's what I think for the monsters as well. You got a picture of Al Capone even in, in our game magazine. Check it out. <laughs> picture of fucking Al Capone in our shit. Huh? Shit. My game is down right now, too, man. I'm fucking down right now. hate that too because I was <coughs> I'm with I, I, I have a whole there's a whole group of us that play and when I'm not in it that I'm pissing puss a man short. I don't like that. <coughs> well um, what time is it?
temperatures man uh we're gonna be sitting at 107 on friday That means doors closed, fucking air on. <laughs> air on, movies on, that's what that says. 108 degrees outside, fucking 70 inside. Cost you 60 bucks just to run it that day. Fuck, <laughs> terrible. I've had my electricity bill, motherfucker. All right, man. I'm going to take a... Uh, I think I'm going to take a run to the store. I'm going to get me some... Uh, Grapes and some uh, orange peanut can, orange circus peanuts uh, for tonight. So I will see you guys after a while. I'll catch you when I get back. Howdy.